वेलकम टू माई चैनल एंड टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द असाइनमेंट्स फॉर सेमिस्टर फर्स्ट फॉर मार्केटिंग मैनेजमेंट सब्जेक्ट फॉर अप्रैल 2022 ट्वेंटी टू साइकिल सो एज वी हैड ऑलरेडी डिस्कस इन अवर प्रीवियस वीडियोज दैट अप्रैल ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू साइकिल इज स्पेसिफिकली फॉर दोज हु हैव नॉट गिवन द असाइनमेंट्स अपलोडेड असाइनमेंट इन द डिसम्बर साइकिल डिसम्बर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन साइकिल और माइट बी ड्यू टू सम इशूज दे विल गेट अ कॉपी केस और माइट बी नॉट एबल टू क्लियर दैट असाइनमेंट सो ओनली फॉर सच स्पेसिफिक specific uh, cases uh, uh, students need to upload uh, the assignments again in april cycle so this is not for all the students so uh, that's the first thing uh, now just uh, coming to the questions so let's quickly see the assignments so this is the assignments uh, which you have uh, been received and uh, if you see there are three questions as we have discussed already each question carries 10 marks and uh, uh, the number of word limit is 1000 words so it's maximum 1000 words and uh, for first second question is 1000 1000 words and 10 marks and the third question is comprises of uh, two parts the third a and third b and each uh, carries 5 5 marks and uh, the word limit is of uh, 500 words so let's quickly see the questions and just see that uh, what needs to be written in that particular question which page numbers to be referred from the book and uh, what needs to be written uh, again uh, i had already said in the previous videos as well that um, you can refer to the book you can refer to the internet but that's for reference purpose only don't directly copy paste from there otherwise uh, you will fall into plagiarism or might be you will get a copy case so you can just refer the content from there and after that just understand what is being asked in the question what needs to be written and finally you need to write the content in your own words so let's start with our first question okay so uh, this is the first question the concept of reserving an ola scooter by paying rupees 499 means that the customer will be first in line to purchase it when the company announces its deliveries the company also gives an option to cancel and get a refund anytime based on the segmentation plan an appropriate uh, based on the uh, the statement plan an appropriate segmentation targeting for the ola scooter considering the profile of an indian customer right so Uh, first of all uh, the question is about the ola scooter ola electric which is coming into the market recently where you can just book it and uh, if you don't want to get it then you can just simply uh, ask for the refund so that that's being asked in the question so based on that you just need to provide two things the very first one is the appropriate segmentation technique and the second one is appropriate targeting technique so let's discuss about what is segmentation what is targeting and after that we need to see that what will be the right fit for this question okay so uh, the page numbers which you need to refer is page number 129 and 136 so uh, what we uh, need to write into this being it's a thousand words question so definitely you just need to explain what is market segmentation what are the types of market segmentation then we comes to the market targeting then the types of marketing technique uh, market targeting and lastly explain in respect to the question case study right so let's go to the page number 129 of your book page number 129 okay so this is about market segmentation so firstly you just need to explain it after that you just need to explain its four types the geographic one uh, the demographic one the psychographic one and the last one is the behavioral right so if you see there is so much of lengthy uh, words or contents mentioned in the book definitely you need not to uh, explain in detail but just you just need to explain in four to five lines or maybe you can just go to eight to nine lines so uh, if i talk about uh, the segment then the very first one is the geographic one where uh, you just divide the uh, the customers based on their geographies like maybe particular city or maybe particular uh, village or maybe particular country so definitely this segmentation technique is not the right fit for our question right next comes as the demographic one so in demographic we just need to divide the market based on the age factor or you can say the lifestyle or the gender or income or occupation and other factors like religion and the generation so again this can be a demographic segmentation technique for our ola scooter but definitely again this is not a perfect fit for one because here we are just talking about the very generic statement of 499 rupees pay and you will get the refund right so this is also seems to be a little bit uh, fit but not the right fit now moving to the third 
one. The th third one comes to as the psychographic. So in psychographic, is it's simply uh, based on the personalities. Like uh, uh, every person has a different lifestyle. Some are into the having different personalities, uh, different culture, and everything. So uh, psychographic is again not seems not to be the right fit. And last but not the least comes as the behavioral segmentation. So behavioral means based on the knowledge, based on the attitudes, uses, responses to our product. This seems to be a right fit for our question. Why? Because uh, it's a very normal thing that uh, if we go in the market and somebody says, "Okay, boss, uh, if you purchase and use it uh, for a trial version, maybe seven days or ten days, and if you don't like the product, then we will provide a refund." So it's a common mentality that uh, we can think that, "Okay, just try, give it a try." If we find it useful, then definitely we can continue with this product. Otherwise, uh, uh, they are just offering us a refund. So behavior, responses, uh, user mentality, thinking comes into the part of behavioral. segmentation and this seems to be the perfect fit for our question of the ola scooters right so segmentation part is pretty much clear now coming to our next part so next part comes on the page number 130 six uh, yeah uh, there is one more thing which you can add uh, okay so maybe you can just specify multiple segmentation bases that's purely an optional one maybe you can just mention that uh, uh, many a times it happens that a single uh, segmentation technique won't be the right fit so uh, in that case we can just offer the multiple segmentation bases so uh, that's that's the optional part but yes if you have uh, less words to write in and you want to increase your word count then definitely you can just write four or five lines out of it right now moving to the page number 136 now next comes as the marketing tech, uh, targeting it means to which market you uh, you are going to plan target and uh, it's for a, a varied complete base or it's for a particular small uh, market or uh, what's all about so firstly you just need to explain a, a little bit about the market uh, targeting what is this all about or the market segments being divided then comes as the four segments the very first one is the undifferentiated marketing the second one is differentiated third one is concentrated fourth one is the micro marketing right so in this case if i talk about the right fit for the targeting strategy then it seems to be a very undifferentiated one it's a mass one it's it's not for any specific person or for the any particular area or anything uh, which is specific to one commodity or one society so it's it's very common to all the customers so it seems to be the right fit undifferentiated but yes we need to specify others as well like what is differentiated in differentiated we have um, the different products for the different class the third comes as the concentrated again it covers a smaller segment in comparison to the differentiated marketing and last but not the least comes as the uh, micro marketing it's it's uh, purely based on the individual persons and uh, it's uh, you can say it's uh, it's a customized one so uh, this comes into the last one where it's divided into two one the uh, uh, it's a local marketing and the individual marketing right so uh, from our question ola scooters uh, it seems that uh, uh, undifferentiated marketing is the uh, right fit for this because it It, it's targeting the whole community or the whole country so that's why we prefer for the undifferentiated marketing for our question right so uh, this needs to be covered in the first question i think the first question is pretty much clear uh moving to the second question uh, which uh, which is about a game the after pubg mobile re entered the indian market in the form of battle grounds mobile india by dance uh, maybe attempted something similar with the tiktok by dance applied for a new target trademark having tiktok as a word mark uh, with the ministry of commerce and industry so uh, such as a suitable promotion mix for our tiktok so promotion mix is definitely it's coming newly into the market and uh, we try to just promote it as much as possible so uh, there are so many promotion mix strategies we need to cover and we just need to see how it can be the right fit for our new tiktok application for for our country so uh, we just need to refer to page number 313 so going to the page number 313 Okay, so it's about the promotion mix, uh, which is also known as the marketing communication mix. So firstly, you just need to specify a little bit about promotion mix, and after that, you just need to specify all of these five ones: uh, the advertising, sales promotion, personal selling, PR, and the last one is the direct and digital marketing. Right. So all these things, these are the very generic one, and if you go down, it's it's been mentioned in detail. Definitely, you also need to cover all these strategies with respect to the TikTok. Like if I talk about the advertising, then maybe you just um, uh, sponsoring it. 
it uh, using some uh, you can say some um, uh, some celebrity maybe amitabh bachchan or maybe shahrukh khan or maybe any cricketer or many, maybe any women uh, personality so based on that uh, you can just do the advertising uh, from some renowned personality then second comes as the sales promotion where you are just uh, encouraging to purchase and uh, you are uh, giving some uh, coins or you can uh, say some you redeem points uh, based on that uh, uh, customers will just try to go for more and more for the paid versions for this uh, uh, game uh, then next uh, for this tiktok then next comes is a personal selling definitely there is the option of uh, just uploading the video so uh, uh, based on personal promotions and personal selling you can also uh, just promote this stuff then next comes is the uh, pr the personal relations definitely when you are just going into the market and uh, you are giving some public offerings you are publicizing something you need to publicize using some coding spanners that comes into the pr part and last one is the uh, sorry uh, that comes uh, uh, sorry public relation comes is when you are just uh, uh, mouth publicity when uh, somebody is uh, appreciating this thing and somebody is liking that thing and he is or she is promoting to some other friend and it comes as a pr part and direct and digital marketing is via mobiles or maybe via laptop my internet or maybe via some ads advertisement Uh, into some uh, by just directly connecting with the customers that comes into the direct and digital marketing so firstly you just need to write journey about all these things and after that you just need to specify how tiktok will be the right fit and how we can use such these pro- promotion techniques for your tiktok so uh, this is pretty much straight forward so that's the second question moving to the third question so third a is about read the case and answer the following question uh, based on the case britannia mary gold is facing a severe competition in a market uh, where there are leaders due to the entry of the new players the uh, company has witnessed a decline in the sales the marketing head has called for the meeting along with the brand marketing team to discuss the way how to face the increasing competition what line extension strategies would you suggest to counter the competition right so it's uh, very much uh, uh, from the case study is pretty much clear that um, mary gold is into the uh, one of the leading companies into the biscuits and uh, uh, recently you will find a lot many biscuits coming into the market so how uh, we can just think of increasing the sales promotion and continue with the brand continue with the uh, sales which was happening couple of years back so we just need to uh, specify the right uh, li- uh, line extension strategy so let's see what's uh, uh which page numbers to refer and what needs to be uh, right into this so going to the page number 189 okay so uh, what needs to be written it's the introduction to the line extension then the various strategies and explain in respect to the question case study so uh, if i talk about the line extension so it means you are uh, you are just simply extending the uh, existing brand in uh, new forms color size uh, flavor so if i talk about marigold biscuit so uh, maybe you can just uh, provide the chocolate biscuit uh, maybe you can just change the uh, uh, change the sh- shape so that uh, the kids start liking it uh, maybe you can go for the sugar free one for adults and uh, who are uh, very much uh, health freaky and who are very much uh, possessive for their health and other concerns uh, uh, maybe you can just opt for other options like uh, Uh, you can just uh, uh, add more flavors to it uh, maybe you can just uh, give it different forms uh, you can just uh, add more different things uh, to the existing biscuits that's that's the way how you can just uh, uh, use the line extension technique for uh, this product that's that's a very short question and definitely it's 500 words so maybe you can just come up with 350 or 400 words that's that totally fine so that you need to specify in this question and uh, coming to the next question suggest an appropriate promotion mix, mix for the britannia marigold so if you see it's coming the same thing which we had mentioned into the second question so going to the page number 313 so if you see the again a uh, promotion mix uh, things the same but here you just need to cut short it to 500 words so don't just specify in details of the promotion mix and if i talk about the five techniques the five ways of promotion mix advertising sales promotion personal selling personal relations public relations and digital and dark, uh, direct marketing so just explain it uh, in short and specific with uh, uh, respect to the case study like how we can advertise it uh, our biscuits how we just do 
about the personal selling and how we can just provide the free uh, sample versions, sample trial options, uh, how we can go to the certain malls and offer certain kind of games so which uh, they can get some hampers from this and there are a lot many techniques so you just need to stick to this particular case study only because that's a very short question of 500 words so I think uh, that's uh, the third B question so we have covered all the three questions and if you have any doubts or facing any issue just you can feel free to connect to me at ngsc.mba.gmail.com if you like this video do like do subscribe and stay connected for further videos for other subjects and coming SAMs thank you so much